My name is Asteria and your mom from Okamule. I'm standing here to glorify the name of Jesus Christ, 37 Apostle S.S. Shombe. So I have been suffering from sickness for the past 26 years. So I have been having a abdominal pain. So I have been having a terrible pain in the, and and I am also having white discharge. Madam, you are welcome to tell us that when you have been having this sickness, where did you went in seek of solution? Yeah, I mean, well, we can go to the doctor and the doctor, or the doctor and the doctor, or the doctor and the doctor, or the So as I've been having this abdominal pain, when I got married in 2014, so the pain became severe. So it moved on the right side. So it will be like there's something that is biting. And sometimes like a itching. And sometimes like there's a, a snake moving. And sometimes like something that wants to come out but that is pressed but is not able. So I have been going to hospitals here and there. And uh, went to private doctors. No, no, and uh, I will be for a machine that would that, it, that that used to scan the women on their private parts. But I could not get any help. I have been going to which doctors and the different uh, revival churches. From there, I met one of the brethren that worships here. Madam, before you come to Apostle Shobe Ministries, you stated that when you got married, the situation got worse. How did that attack affect your marriage as a husband and wife? So my uh, my husband understood it because he also received counseling because they were saying that uh, it was a STD disease. But, but when they did um, the investigations, they realized that it's not the, the one. How did it affect your daily work? Yeah, Yes, 
la loi et mania moussine la mouta moye ramasi et trine et mouta moussine et euh, badly affect me affected me because it's like there was a stone that is on my abdomen whenever you are moving you are paining So I came and met a servant of God, Apostle Shonbe. And then he gave me a prophecy. He said that he's going to set free my womb. He prayed for me. Madam, before you continue, when the Son of God prophesied that he will deliver or set free your womb, how did you confirm that prophecy to be true? Yeah, I don't know if you have a man who is 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 a Yes, I confirmed the prophecy because uh, the, the main problem was my own. He prayed for me. And I continue coming to church for Sundays receiving prayers. So I want to use the living water that I received from this ministries. Madam, before you continue, we just want to take you a little bit back. We want to understand that when you have been going through this sickness, does it used to come and go or it was consistent? Was it a day-to-day -day pain? Yes, it was So I have been experiencing this pain daily and I could have, I could feel the biting and the movement moving objects in my own. You want to tell us that ever since 1998 that pain had been there and it was severe. Yes, I have been experiencing that pain daily and I could have the movement of to take us through your testimony when you encounter the Son of God, Apostle S. Eshomi. He prayed for me and because I, I remember I, Specific day when you were having a mass prayer at Matano, the previous church. So that I can So I remember when I was praying, I was also just uh, holding my hands where I used to feel that moving object. That's also where I was touching and praying that it must come out. From there when I've been using the living water that I see from this ministry. So I've been uh, uh, using that water when I'm bathing. I also bathed my private bath with the living water. From there, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus Christ. From there, I never, uh, I never experienced any pain, even the moving objects. 
no pain in your womb, everything disappeared. Not even the discharge also stopped. Madam, we are seeing a paper on the board and a health passport on your hands. Can you explain to us what is it that is written there? Yeah, I mean, on Twitter, on Bakila, or Gakele Doko, yeah, the fact that you are just a special champion. For Gakele Doko, I am going to go to so it's just uh, the medical report just consists of what is in or what I was going through. So it consists of a medical history that uh, yes, I've been going through this sickness and the pain, the problem, but I'm not getting any better. No. Madam, we have a question before you continue. No. The health passport that you are having in your head, do you want to tell us that it's the same health passport when you started experiencing that sickness since 1998? Yeah, I know that the problem is so she said that no, that is not the one I decided to read. I've been changing uh, medical reports. What was the reason behind when you used to change her passport? Yeah, I'm not sure that I'm not so uh, I just wanted for well, as I'm changing a different doctor, so I'm just starting afresh. That was my aim. Madam, you want to tell us that you believed that when you were using the same health passport, it was not uh, giving you or giving the right reports to the doctors to treat you in the right way because they just read and realize that you have been being treated that sickness which is not uh, getting any better. Yeah, yeah, so yes, that is the main aim so that the doctor will concentrate and focus more on my situation so that is yeah to do some new examinations. You are welcome to take us through on the board. Yeah, or uh, come wrong or to in the she will have a little. Okay, I don't know. Oh, I This paper is just about uh, uh, the sickness that I've been going through. Yeah, yeah, I can say in my So when they took a sample from the white discharge, so that they take it to the laboratory to examine if there is any bacteria. But uh, the paper or the examination shows that there is no bacteria. What kind of words of encouragement are you giving to those who are going through the same situation? And they are listening to you today. Yeah, I pass get to go now. While Colombo is about to be killed, now I have five people to be killed. Now you have to pick one and one. And I get to go now. I have to be killed. Now you have to pick one and one. And I get to go now. And I get to go now. So I just want to tell someone, especially those that have been suffering for long. Get over the top. 
if you see in the line that you went to the hospital for many times, but there's no change, you are not getting, getting any better. Come and seek for Jesus Christ. At Apostle Shombe Ministries. Jesus Christ is here, he's alive, he will heal you. Hallelujah, hallelujah, let's give it to Jesus Christ. We give all the glory to Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.